Well, we're back in Ransdale again today, just right on top at North York Moors, roof of the world it feels like. Uh, last time we were here it was snow all over the place, but now the snow's gone, but the wind is still blowing. And last time we were here I spotted this little bridge, um, right on the bend, and there's a lovely little brook runs through it. And I thought, right, if we get the conditions, I'm going to go back there, I want to try and get some, some film of this. So we can see there, if we look down, got the water just nicely coming through and then off up the valley. So we've got the valley at that side and if I spin round and we come round here now, the sun's going to catch your lens but we've got that little valley with all the sheep down in the bottom. So that's where I'm going to have a look, we're going to go down there and see what we've got to shoot. Okay, we're finally out of the wind there as so I just walked down that hill. It's blowing an absolute gale at the top and down here it's lovely and sheltered. Sun's out, it's quite warm, good bit of cloud detail and just behind me, you can see there, behind me we've got the brook running off. So I'm going to go down there, see if we can find any compositions. Uh, if we don't, it doesn't really matter because it's such a lovely place, it's just nice to be out here. I've got a composition uh, just in front of me which is a little brook which is coming down then we've got some silver birch on the left hand side and the cloud detail just going across uh, it makes quite a nice pleasing little scene especially when we've got the white fluffy uh, clouds in the back so that's the composition we've got there we've got the brook going off we've got those silver birch trees and we've got the lovely cloud detail and lovely blue sky there so if we come down onto the back of the camera You'll see the composition there. So we've got the histogram up. Um, it's blowing a little bit on the highlights, but not, not too bad. So if I just bring that down so it clips it, we've got 30 of a second at F16. And we're in aperture priority. I've focused about a third of the way in. So two second time, and I'll just take that shot. And that's the shot that we've got there. Quite a pleasing little, uh, little shot, that. Okay, a little bit precarious, we've got the tripod one leg in the water, the other two hopefully on firm ground. I've come down quite low now, quite low down to the water so that we've got the, the shot just looking up the brook and looking through those uh, reeds just on the right hand side. So we're going to come on to F11, that gives us a 50th of a second, I'm going to focus a on somewhere on the reeds just up there we'll take the focus on that and we'll take the shot got the two second timer on there we go so I'm just sat on a rock at the side watching this water coming down on the way up we've got daffodils out the side of the road spring's finally come we got rid of all that winter weather, although we haven't really had a winter. And now we've just got, everything's coming into bud. The trees will soon have the leaves on, and then this will be a completely different scene. But just for now, I'm just going to sit here and just drink it in for a few minutes.
another little bridge going across there and we got that fallen tree behind it looks like it's died at some point rotted away from the bottom possibly being cut down as well and that's just laid across nice bubbling water as we're coming through bit of white water and then that rock is the foreground interest so on the back of the camera that's what we've got camera's nice and leveled we're on manual this time because I've just done another pano shot uh, 15th of a second at f11 camera's leveled off vertically and that looks quite a pleasing shot we've just got the the whole of that fallen tree should be in and we've just got a little bit of the cutting off of the other tree so plenty of room for me to crop back if I need to later on so two second timer as usual and I'll take that shot and uh, there we go so let's go for, walk a bit further down light levels are dropping now we're getting some cloud coming in so we'll just have a quick look and then probably start making his way back just looking down the further down the valley there the light levels keep changing it's coming out absolutely superb at the minute but there's a lot of black clouds coming across got a stepping stones there little handrail don't think it'll do much if you start to fall though so this is somewhere that I'm definitely going to be coming back to but I think for now I'm going to put the camera away walk back up and just enjoy the scenery okay just putting the camera uh, away uh, and a barn owl came out of the holly tree that's just in front of me here so what I'm going to do I've got the long lens on the camera I'm going to walk up just in case we see it I might be able to get a couple of shots looked into the tree and there's actually a nest in there Okay, so I think what I'm going to do is call that quits for today now. Um, lovely little walk up this valley in Bransdale. Got the stream running through, quite a few bridges, the light level's gone now. Getting a few black clouds coming over, so I'm going to go and find something to eat. So if you liked it, subscribe, hit the bell, give it a, a like and share it with somebody. And I'll see you in the next one. Bye.